Hey guys, today I'm gonna to show you how to make a delicious and really quick coleslaw. It's perfect as a side item, but it's even better on top of a Carolina-style pulled pork barbecue sandwich. Can you catch that foreshadowing? We've got a video like that coming up really soon, all right? But today, let's dive right into some coleslaw. I'm gonna start by cutting 12 ounces of cabbage. I'm gonna use some purple cabbage and some green cabbage. It just adds a really nice color to the coleslaw. Just a quick tip, if you plan on making this coleslaw a few days ahead of time, don't use purple cabbage. What's gonna happen is it's gonna leach its color into the coleslaw and you'll end up having a batch that's totally purple. But if you're gonna make this coleslaw and eat it in the same day or two, uh, use both. It looks really pretty and it's, it's a nice presentation. Anyways, 12 ounces of coleslaw. I'm just gonna thinly slice this stuff. So going real thin here. If you want more texture in your coleslaw, you can make your cuts a little wider. But let's get this uh, cabbage in the bowl, all right? And then we'll move on to cutting up the green cabbage. Beautiful. All right, finishing up the green cabbage. We're gonna get it into the bowl with the purple cabbage and we're gonna move on to uh, julienne some of our carrots. All right, we need four ounces of julienne carrots. And I've peeled my carrot. I'm just gonna cut the tip and the uh, bottom off, like so. Cut them into manageable size lengths, something like this. All right. All right, so uh, done with the carrots. <laughs> I'm trying these knives out. A uh, knife manufacturer sent these to me uh, to, to try out on my videos, but um, didn't realize how dull they were out of the box. So it's really hard to julienne carrots, finely julienne carrots, with a fairly dull knife. So I'm gonna have to pass this uh, over the stone a few times to get it nice and sharp. So uh, four ounces of carrots go into the bowl. All right, just like that. Now we gotta put this aside and we're gonna make our dressing for the coleslaw. I've got six ounces of mayonnaise, and to that, I'm gonna add my secret weapon, a little bit of sour cream. This is three ounces. If you guys want volume measurements, check the video description box below, uh, below the video. This is gonna give a little bit of tang, a little bit more fat in the dressing. Uh, nice addition. Brings another, another element of flavor into it. So I'm just gonna mix this around, like so, just get it incorporated. To that, I'm gonna add two teaspoons of cider vinegar. And there we go. Along with two teaspoons of white sugar and a half teaspoon of celery seed, whole celery seed. Pretty common ingredient in coleslaw. A few grinds of cracked black pepper. And then salt to taste. I'm just gonna add a few pinches here to start. Can always add a little bit more once the coleslaw is put together. So give this a good stir. Make sure all these ingredients are incorporated evenly. Perfect. Now, bringing this coleslaw over here, all the shredded cabbage and the carrots. Let's go ahead and add the dressing directly to the bowl with all of the veggies. Just like that, so easy. Then just mix this all together and adjust the seasoning as necessary. That's all you gotta do. All right, looks good. Let's give it a taste. Delicious, just needs a teeny bit more salt, just like that. Give it another stir. Mmm, bingo, delicious. Give the coleslaw a try. Again, perfect as a side item, but even better on a pulled pork barbecue sandwich. That video will be coming up real soon. Transfer this to a smaller container or just wrap this bowl in plastic. It'll keep for a few days. And that's it, folks. If you like the video, please give me a like, hit that subscribe button, and I'll catch you next time.